All right, hi everyone, it's Natalie here, back with a message for you guys. Hope everyone is doing well. Let's tap in. See what's going on for this reading. Holy Spirit and angels, what is the message? What is the message for the collective? Let's get the energy in the highest vibration. I'm hearing we don't practice. We don't practice. Tree, let them go. We have confidence. Comes with time and practice. Wow, I just heard we don't practice, though, before that came out. Uh, feast, slow down and celebrate yourself. And then we have protest, start a revolution. I feel like you guys are ready for something here. Yeah, justice is coming. Don't, ex don't seek anyone's approval. Stand up for yourself. All right, so... You let people go or you let certain energies go that put you under some sort of microscope. And I heard we don't practice. These people like want you to like get some sort of... I feel like people are mad at you because you don't practice something. You just do it. People are trying to protest against you because you don't practice something. Clarify tree, let them go. Or you don't do something the way they want you to do it. Tree, let them go. Opportunity beckons. Oh, this is someone who... They judge you because of what you do, but deep down, they're sad. Because they judge you for what you do. Yeah, darkest fears. Actually, you actually, whatever's going on here, it's like, you. they had the chance to work with you, but they chose not to. So they wanted to attack you, attack your work, or make it seem like, oh, you don't practice enough, or you don't do this enough anyway, so... But no, nah, that's not... It, actually, you're actually where you're supposed to be right now in life. These people just wanted to attack your confidence because you had a lot of it. Clarify confidence. Feeling alone. I'm hearing... There's a mask on out here that feels alone. Yeah, just breathe is here. Lead in the reverse. I feel like also there's an energy where you, if you're a feminine, you don't work with masculines that don't get it off rip. There's a masculine or distorted masculine in a way who's like putting women under microscopes constantly all the time. And he ends up missing out on his opportunities with them. And when that happens, it's like, okay, you're not obligated to sit there and wait for them. Or you're not obligated to like someone here just thought that you were moving uh, you were not moving accordingly in life or something clarify protest start a revolution and now they're ending up feeling alone we have love abounds okay give me another one feast slow down and celebrate yourself slow down and celebrate yourself solar plexus chakra i feel like you do it yourself you do something by yourself on your own so someone turned their back on you yeah they didn't open up to you because they weren't trying to seek the truth about success and growth and you weren't going to fight with them either so there's something here about like uh they turn their back on you and you still were, were able to make something happen on your own. Now I feel like you're either attracting love or you have like a lot of suitors or something. And now they're, they're, they're sort of regretting it here. But they turn their back on you. 
This person like to attack your self-esteem a lot to make you feel alone. Now they're alone. What's this talking about? This solar plexus energy is divine masculine energy, but it's on top of the feminine. So the feminine had to tap into her own divine masculine energy because she had a masculine in her life that wouldn't do it. He would always turn his back on her. Like he didn't want to do it. Like he was afraid to do it or he was afraid to step up or he was afraid to do something here. Well, come to find out they regret it because you let them go or something. Racism, prejudice could have been because of that. They're prejudiced. They prejudged you. Materials, diamonds, a goal. Yeah, this person was constantly worried about uh, materials. We have loves being evil. They have some sort of like a, they don't know how to be a good person either. Very materialistic, only caring about money or like what people look like. Okay, so we have cyberbullying and stalking. They were also maybe involved in cyberbullying or stalking you, keeping track on, keeping track of you on the internet. Yeah, they judged you, but you were a star the whole time. They didn't think that you could be a star. Maybe you were like telling them, hey, I got this acting gig or I wrote this song or I started some sort of business and they were judging you the entire time. Wow, we got the Vine Sister and Earth Angel here. So you may have a karmic sister or a karmic brother or you're out of all your siblings you're actually like the divine sibling you got some people that love being evil around you yeah that's stirring the pot hmm i feel like this masculine regrets it now because they see what's going on i feel like this person is out in the cold or like they feel like wow this person can actually find love or they're actually going to find love here because they don't okay I feel like someone tried to beat you down so that you would not find love or partnerships or something like that. But come to find out, you're actually going to get love or you're actually very much divine. You're an earth angel and people just love to be evil around you. I feel like this masculine that was involved in this regrets it now. And they definitely misjudged you or something. They made you feel alone. They made you build up your confidence by yourself. You did. And now you're celebrating yourself. You're where you're supposed to be in life. And this person's like in regret because they had nothing to do with your success. They were racist against you or they judged you or they said that you couldn't do something here. Nine of Wands in the reverse. Okay, so they're stopping that. They're stopping being prejudice towards uh you yeah now they're stuck in their head now they're thinking am i the one that's actually worthless probably because they were involved in cyberbullying or there's people around this person that was involved in cyberbullying you and they didn't do much about it yeah queen of swords so you have a clear mind Queen of Cups. Wow. Air and water. You're very truthful and caring. This is what makes you divine. This is what makes you an earth angel. Yeah, high priestess. Also, yeah, your intuition is like on point when it comes to something. I'm also getting like you're not really out there when it comes to like what you can do. You have a lot of hidden powers here. You're very mature in nature. Your nature is like very mature, very divine. Four cups. But they rejected you. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, they're really like criticizing you, but I feel like all this criticizing is going back onto them. They're seeing that either they love to be evil or there's people around them that love to be evil. And they're starting to see the difference between you and another person or you and certain people here. Yeah, I feel like something is backfiring onto them or they feel blocked from your energy here. They feel like you know a lot too. 
which is another reason why they feel like you can like tell the future or you just know you just know a lot and they don't so they may need you for some sort of advice but they're blocked from you i'm also getting like someone like sold you out for materials diamonds and gold Or if you have materials, diamonds and gold, they try to like stalk you for it. I don't know. We have the uh, Ten of Swords in the reverse, the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah. They wasted a lot of time trying to betray you because they couldn't betray you. I'm getting like you're like a really loving person. You're a really loving person. It's like your heart is big. They try to protest against you and none of these people that protest against you could like defeat you. Yeah, Four of Wands in reverse, King of Swords in reverse, Ten of Wands in reverse. They couldn't defeat you. They couldn't leave you burdened. At this point, they're just talking about themselves. Whatever they're doing, they're just talking about themselves. I feel like you have you're like in this bubble, this protective bubble. There must have been a lot of people that gained up on you guys recently. Nine of Wands in the reverse. We got the Hierophant in the reverse here. With the Six of Swords and the Nine of Swords. So this person is real worried that you're just going to move on. I feel like you are. You have already moved on though. You've definitely moved on. They're worried that you're moved on to peace. There's some sort of unorthodox belief that they try to get you to stick to or something. But you're not doing that. Yeah, now they're burdened because you're actually moving on to like... Uh, this is an ex, definitely. You don't want to be around them anymore. You want to be somewhere else or like you have attracted a new tribe or something. Clarify the queen of swords. King of pentacles. Eight of pentacles in the reverse. So this queen of swords has, like I said, a lot of masculine energy within her. On the surface, she's very feminine. But beneath the surface, she's very masculine. Yeah, justice, the world in the reverse. They try to like get this person to miss out on money or something, but her finances are fine or something like that. Why the Queen of Cups? We have the Knight of Cups here with a tower. Why do I feel like these people think that you can't attract love, but you are what you attract and you are love here. These people or this person is shocked that you're attracting someone on your level or they're going to be shocked that you're attracting someone on your level. Someone that saw you who you were from the beginning. Not someone who saw you for who you were and tried to attack you because of it. Not someone who... Um, didn't see your worth and was afraid of you or they prejudged you someone out here is seeing your worth from the beginning and it's like causing someone to like I don't know like they I'm picturing someone at work and they can't work they can't work correctly because they're constantly thinking about you clarify the high priestess I feel like you guys are really quiet yeah we got the devil here and the hermit in the reverse yeah you guys are really quiet in this energy Someone may try to like be in your energy to like throw toxic energy at you or something or act ignorant because they know that you know everything or something like that. It's like they're trying to throw you off whack, I guess. This person's like real toxic, codependent on your energy, codependent on getting reactions out of you too. I'm hearing dethroned. Someone is dethroned or you took someone off the throne in a way by not doing much clarify the four of cups these people are rejected or they just feel like yeah i can't cups in the reverse with the moon card yeah this person's all up in their feelings right now they have people they have energies around them it looks like that are like making them feel like they have to be evil towards you they're losing their mind because they know it's not right, but they can't stop doing it. It's like there's secrets here. This person would rather be rejected by you than to tell you the truth. That's also what I'm getting here. Even though you know the truth, but they, they're never going to confess it to fix the relationship. 
they're just going to continue to be, you know, reckless and let you leave. I feel like this person's going to let you leave, but they're so stressed out right now. Clarify the Knight of Swords in reverse. And they might even try to project energy onto you. Page of Wands in reverse. Uh, we have the Page of Swords and the King of Wands reverse, Nine of Cups. This person thinks that they could, like, do something with their words to keep you stuck. This person's, like, really abusive. But if you leave, you leave. There's like a lot of bad news here uh, that's going on with this person. I feel like also they're sending people to you to bully you. Or they feel like they can send people to you to bully you because they can't do it themselves because they're too weak to do it. Yeah, who the heck is this? Clarify the Eight of Wands in the reverse. Ace of Swords in the reverse, Three of Wands here, and the Ten of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, I don't know what they, they were expecting. They may have sent their family to come attack you. And they missed. This person is in denial that anything is going to happen between you two. Yeah, they, they sent someone to like, they sent like chaos magic to you or something. To try to attack you, but it's not working. They were manifesting some some sort of lie to work on you. And if they got a lot of people on their side, they, they suggested that the lie would work, but it's not working anymore. Clarify the Ten of Wands or the Ten of Swords in the reverse. So you're not in any sort of traumatic endings here, but now it has to all go back onto them. Yeah, Seven of Swords in reverse. They've been caught. I feel like you guys are being blessed in this energy, and they're being burdened here and caught. Like a lot of energy of them being burdened and caught because they thought that they can like end something for you. They're doing absolutely too much around an earth angel and it's, it's doing nothing but exposing them. They're stalking you on the internet is what I just heard. So be careful what you post. Clarify the seven of pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, they're losing energy. Like, they're losing something here. Wow. The lovers, nine of swords. This is what they're afraid of. They're afraid of you going into another connection and not paying any attention to them, getting what you deserve. They do not want you to do this because it's going to make them look stupid in the public eye. Four of pentacles here. Yeah, it's like they're trying to hold on to you out of, like, pure... Just trying to save face. Trying to save their reputation, it looks like. It's not working, though. Four of wands in the reverse. Yeah, this is a false twin flame. Or a false relationship or something that just didn't work out. We have the Death card, the Magician, and the Page of Cups in reverse. They manifested this themselves. They manifested this themselves. And I feel like for some reason they're trying to blame other people. But you can't really blame other people when it comes to this. I feel like this person here just needs to blame themselves. They were like being real evil towards you. Yeah, they were judging you. This, this person has a problem with judging people. We have humor here. Yeah, you were... Yeah, this person was like um, laughing at you in your dreams or something. Well, all that's going back on to them. I feel like while they were putting you through something, you were just looking at the brighter side of, a, of something and they were looking at you like you were crazy or like you needed to be stopped. Oh, wow. Humor actually came out. This is health. courage yeah they can't they don't have the same courage as you they can try and make it seem like they do i feel like this person doing things like going to the gym and like eating healthier as if that's gonna bring you closer to god like god's not gonna just automatically start blessing you just because you stop eating burgers is different it's is more deeper than that i don't feel like this person realizes this we have loneliness I mean, it's all part of detoxifying and cleansing yourself, but that doesn't mean that you know God. Like, you know what I mean? I feel like this person is trying to do things like become healthier, like uh, eat better, exercise better, but it's not bringing them any closer to God because they're doing everything but going to God. We have fear here and trust. I feel like you told them this too. They'll do anything but pick up a Bible. They'll do anything but talk to god they're, they're just gonna make them their bodies 
they're just gonna look healthier okay but that doesn't i mean i guess but no <laughs> friendship is here we have friendship courage trust fear and loneliness this person is in fear that you will actually attract someone that's going to see you for who you are the first time that they see you this person is in denial i feel like they're trying to like run away from judgment right now and the way that they're doing it is that they're doing healthy things like i'm not here to judge people that are doing healthy things but this person here is running from judgment by doing healthy things. <laughs> like, why weren't you doing those healthy things before you were put under judgment? It's like, give me something like that. I don't know. It might not resonate for everybody, but this is your guys' reading. Hope this resonates for you. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.